What's up everyone? Welcome to this little mini vlog. We're here at Universal Studios Florida outside of Revenge of the Mummy, which was just closed for seven months from massive refurbishment. Really? Seven months? Yeah, oh they were doing a lot of updates, so we're here to see how it's riding and see if we can tell any of the physical differences. We heard there were some uh, screen projection updates, a lot of controls things. Heard that the ride is maybe not as harsh on the braking. However, we have heard that Brandon Fraser is still here and he yes. still needs his cup of coffee. It, so. Seven months and no one got him any coffee. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. So let's go on in and see how it is. Entering the line, it is a 35 minute wait. Right now it is in technical the rehearsals. They're saying not all elements will be working during today's ride, so we'll see. One of the things that a lot of people were speculating was that they were going to get rid of the whole we're behind the scenes of the mummy movie thing, but it looks like that's definitely staying intact because we still have like the busts over here, we've got like a wardrobe section over here, and they're still interviewing everybody like they did in the original. Now, I've not written this as much as many of the hardcore Universal fans did, but the queue to me looks the same, at least in this main room. I think one of the big differences we're going to be seeing is actually when we get up into the station and check out the load times. So it looks like for technical rehearsals, we're only using one side of the dual loading station. Alright, so we just got off Revenge of the Mummy. And I do think that some of the movement in some of the first scenes when it's kind of uh, taking long through the different shows feels a bit more like calculated or like maybe it uh, the pacing. Yeah, it was like a bit more mild in, in how it was. It was just kind of felt like it was like going along. Um, definitely didn't do like as an abrupt of a stop as it has in the yeah. past. I mean, it still has a little bit of a jolt there yeah. towards the end. I did notice um, that I guess maybe we were sitting on some of the blocks a little bit bit longer like when yeah. we went through the first room where all the mummies like pop up spoilers um i feel like usually you kind of by the time the the big face is done talking you're already like going through the door but instead it ended and we still hadn't left but that could yeah. just be like a, a technical yeah reference. well and after uh the ride ended we were sitting on the box for a little bit long so it seems like their dispatches are a little bit shorter i mean not saying that it like took a while like i mean realistically they're probably no, still dispatching from in like 30 seconds you know it, yeah it was still fast um I think, I think some of the projections looked like a little bit crisper. I don't yeah. know for sure. I mean, but I it, think. yeah. I mean, so the refurb, from what I'm gathering, definitely wasn't as extensive as I think a lot of people were like originally imagining. I think it was extensive, but I think it was it was more internal like internal. Stuff, yeah, like yeah. I, I think they redid the control system and stuff. Which would explain why it. why the vehicle was kind of moving. It felt like it was moving through some of the scenes at a little bit different speed. Yeah. I think that some of the timing with some of the audio cues and um, effects were a little bit off, but like I said, it's in technical rehearsal, so I imagine that that will get better over time. We're literally here right after this has reopened. Yeah. So, you I know. think overall, like if you didn't know that this just went down for seven months for a reverb, I don't think it would be apparent. I don't think you would notice, yeah. It's I mean, fine. No, no, I mean, you that's, know, sometimes that's the what they want, right? Sometimes the hardware has to be taken care of, you know? So it's okay. Yeah, absolutely. So, hope you guys enjoyed this one. Let us know if you've been out here to ride Revenge of the Mummy after the refurb. If you're coming here soon, be sure to post those thoughts down below. Thank you so much. We'll see you in the next one.